That's what is that? What I like. A Liberty coin from 1923. Oh, there's all kinds of coins down there. There's all kinds of coins at the bottom of this bag. We just paid $300 for this 5x5 five five abandoned storage unit. was told the owner stored here for over four years and just completely vanished. So over $5,000 paid for this and then just disappeared. We have no idea what happened or what we're about to find, but let's figure it out. First off, I think I should play a little song with this guitar. Oh, you know, so a, that's beautiful already. Did you know I was a musician? I did it. I'm feeling ill because I didn't pay my bill. The funds I lack because I'd rather sell crack. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Jokes aside, this is a Lucero LC100 on there. It's got a serial number on it. This guy's in pretty good shape all around, so. Bet you that's worth a good little amount. These guitars are selling for an average of 75 bucks on eBay, so good start. We have a lot of suitcases. Let's go to this bag first. This one looks soft. So mm -hmm. I feel like I have an unfortunate feeling what's gonna be in here, but we're gonna find out slowly. The front, there's Mail. They couldn't remember his name, but guess what? I have the name right here. <laughs> so right when I'm done with this, I'm gonna figure out what happened to this guy, because right. I'm am nosy. But this is all paperwork. Let's see what's on the side over here. Uh, nothing. Ew, underwear. I'm not touching those. A pair of underwear. <laughs> We're going into the main compartment. Yeah, that's what I thought it looked like clothes. A little bit of protein powder. And is it all clothes though? That's the question. What is that? What is that? Oh, uh, that's a hat. A Never hat. mind. I thought it was like an animal. I was like, uh. Yeah, now this bag is what we thought. It's just close. So I used the mail to look this guy up and I found five different criminal reports of where he was arrested, but they are all hidden. But when I plugged the court case thing into North Carolina's website, I can see it was about three and a half months ago. So something happened, but somehow he's got it covered up. If anyone knows how that's possible, let us know. Should I go to the big brown suitcase or the little black one? Black one. Little one? Oh, that's heavy. What the heck is this? This isn't close. I don't think this is close. If it is, it's really heavy. Do you hear that hit that? Yeah. It's a Lexus brand suitcase. Nice. Is that the car brand? Or well, I mean, Lexus I is a car brand, but I don't yeah. know. Uh, oh, come on. It did not feel like clothes. There's no way the bag's just that heavy. Well, there's a suit. This better not be a bunch of dress clothes. We already got cursed with a unit like that once before. <laughs> we did. Uh, it was all dress clothes. Well, this one's literally all clothes too, but hey, the suitcase has got to be worth at least 10 bucks. I'm getting nervous now, but this first box does look like crap. We kind of thought that was the case because it looked like food and stuff. So let's look in there really quick. Uh, yeah, unfortunately from first impression, that's exactly what it looks like is a bunch of just nasty food. What is this? That, that's sauce. Yeah, unfortunately, this box is garbage. Just because that box is bad doesn't mean that this one has to be, right? Oh, this no. is really heavy. Uh, well, a glass. kinda. That's it's brand dishes, new though. Is it? Uh, Woo. Jeez, okay. This Look at that. Pyrex. It is Pyrex. Am I holding it the right way? I don't know. Can it says you see it? Pyrex two quart thing. <laughs> so, you know what? At least there's some Pyrex here. I hate how breakable glass is. This is why everything in our house is plastic because that clanking you just heard, it scares the living crap out of me. The Pyrex is an easy sale. I got a laundry hamper, but there's something that's not laundry in there. What that is, I don't know. Is that zippers or money that I hear? It better be cash. It better be. It better, what is this? Well, it's his keys to a, what kind of car do you drive, sir? 2016 sleeper? What the heck's that? I don't know. That, we own a 2016 sleeper now. There's a plate. Is that the only thing that was in there? Yeah, the rest of it. No. Now, what is that? What Aha, is that? What is that? Right here. You know what it sounds like? Huh. Seashells. Well, why would somebody have a pocket full of seashells? I don't know. Uh, why does this guy have a pocket full of seashells? It's in the jacket pocket. Yeah. Well, that's like, oh look, you can see it on this side. Why? Does somebody have a pocket full of seashells in a storage unit? Maybe they like seashells. I guess so. At least we got a chair. A chair. That, if nothing else so far, we do have a chair and it is in there. That's at least five to ten dollars. So you know what? There's something. That and a guitar. You just rhymed. I did? It's because I was playing the guitar. I'm just becoming a natural musician. <laughs> You're like, that's a chair and it's in there. Oh, this is heavy. And I was like, ooh. Let's get like a little, you know, a revolver or something. That would be cool. Yeah, that would be cool. Let's see what's in the black case. That would be cool. Open up, open. Okay, this side's like, no, nah, I don't feel I like it. it yeah, yeah, it turns, or it this. slides. It just slides, yeah. Yeah. What is that? Oh. Up, up, up. 
It's a freaking a cooker. cooker thing. That's no <laughs> good. A couple bucks at a yard sale. I just picked up this book bag from the side. Let's see if there's anything inside the front pocket here. One check for how much? Two hundred and sixty-one dollars. Okay, let's okay. just go cash that real quick. <laughs> yeah, no, it'd be kind of probably considered fraud. Uh, yeah, I think so. Possibly, but they do say legally when you buy a unit, everything inside becomes yours. So there's paper. We gotta go to the main compartment because it doesn't feel like clothes. It's something else. Oh boy. Ooh, paper. Papers. The pro I was gonna say the next worst thing, but honestly, I'd rather have clothes than papers because papers are just worthless. The only positive about papers is it gives me the guy's information and stuff so I can look them up and see what happened. What about the little plastic bag down here? Ah, this is, this is all, what, ooh, what is this first? First of all, I saw a music book in there, but this looks like it might be CDs or something. Hopefully they're not just burned copies of stuff. Mix. They're, they're mostly burned, mostly. I'd say it's about Luda. 70% burn, unfortunately. Luda and George Strait. What that's, a combination. That's a weird combination, now. <laughs> some, um, what's it called? Papers, and then we do have some guitar books in here. And what is that? One day an elephant stumped up in the ant house. Oh, that's so sad. Is that a book? It looks like a, it was. A, a story? Uh, I guess so, okay. or music maybe. <laughs> I don't know, either which way, nah. Let's go to the leather bag here. What's inside of this guy? Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, that thing. What else is in here? Can you give me some light? Eh, it's not looking very promising. It's just a bunch of junk and a bunch of lottery tickets. Lottery tickets. tickets. Let's see, what, 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 what do you play? You like $5 tickets, sir? Okay, $5 tickets in there. They're probably... There's a lot in there. Keeping them all, yeah, because, you know, if you win and you hit something, they want to have it for tax stuff. What is that? Antibacterial deodorant soap. Okay, there's no value in here. What's in this bag? Is this one all closed? Ah, uh, it is. So the used clothes, if I didn't say it earlier in a video, if they're used and they're not like jerseys or designer, we just donate them because I don't like to go through it. Ooh, what is this? Oh, look what I see. Alien? Alienware. That's really expensive gaming stuff if it's in there. Uh, and no, it's, what is that? Looks like it was used as a freaking paper holder, unfortunately. Why would know. you do that? Why? That's, that's just wrong on so many levels. This black bag, I feel closed, but I also feel something else. Notebook, Swift, maybe it was a truck driver. Yeah, look, student, so I was probably a truck driver at one point. And your favorite. Yay! We can't go one storage unit without getting you some more hangers. You know what, you can have them all. I'll tangle them up in everything for you. Yes. So I just picked up this bag and there's just a pillow in there, literally just a pillow. But I look at the front and you look at the tag and it says Versace pair or par something on there. You can't see it, I have no light. But if that's real, that's at least a decent chunk of our money back, all right? Next black bag, what is that? I think I might've just heard cash, finally. Did what you? is that, hey, what is this? An hey. Asus laptop, there we go. Now we're in the right direction. Okay. It's actually in pretty good shape. Usually these screens are always cracked. So hey, I'll take that right here. Where's that little... That's what, is that? what I like to hear. It First a off, box. that's a Prada box. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see what's in there. Money, money. Ooh, oh, definitely there some is money. money in there. And some cards. We'll give him his picture back. That's his actual card. But I uh, see a lot of foreign coins and American coins. This is all okay. mail. Uh, look at like some of these old ones here. What is that? <laughs> that's a really old coin in there. I got to get some of this sewing stuff out of the way. So we can get to the coins. Look at this. There's a lot of coins that aren't from the United States in there. You see all that? Yeah. I don't know what, what country these are from, but there is some change mixed in there. But the other coins, I just don't know how to identify if it's silver or anything like that if it's not from the United States. But there's some stuff in there. Okay, so maybe that cool. means the rest of the bag is going to be interesting. The rest of the bag is, what is this? Protein powder, busted open, and a shirt. At least we got the Prada box. This, oh. Whoa. Uh, well. Heavy, huh? That was a heavier bag than I <laughs> thought it was gonna be. But I can't lie to you. It does feel like it's all, and That was yes, like jeans. It's all closed, so. Yeah, we'll just rather, like I said before, rather donate them than sell you stuff. Wanna go to the big suitcase? Sure. Not yet, not yet. Okay, okay. Let's get the stuff that's gonna fall if I move the big suitcase first. So okay. we don't gotta have falling stuff. These shoes, what are they? Aldo. Aldo. Jose Aldo. 
uh, shoes, clothes, clothes. Why would somebody pay five? So far, I'm really curious why anyone would pay five thousand dollars or more to store the stuff that's in here because it's just i thought there was a, something hard at the bottom it was like coming out is it? like what is that that's sticking out down there an umbrella oh okay <laughs> never mind i'm starting to get nervous i'm starting to get oh my goodness what if these bags weighing 800 pounds what's in this guy that looks like randomness yeah this one doesn't feel like clothes let's see if it's the case well what's in here first question Ooh. Mm, bathroom stuff. Not, not, not what I wanted. Let's throw that aside right here. Uh, what is this? Wall, probably a razor. Yeah, that's a, yeah, that's a razor. Put that aside. I still heard like something that sounded like coins in a glass jar. I found a controller in this bag. You mean? Yeah. I'm gonna find it. I found a controller. So there might be a game system somewhere down here. Uh, but as of now. I'm seeing dirty shoes and piles of paper. Ew, like it looks like somebody emptied a vacuum. <laughs> like it's just, ew, paperwork. Uh, what is that, a hard drive? Maybe a hard drive? And yeah, I am not seeing anything remotely cool looking in this bag. Let's go in this little Postmates bag and see what's in here. Ew, ew, what is that? Oh, that's, I don't have a brand on it, but it's very used, so it's not gonna have much resale value. Again, I'd rather just donate it. But inside of here, this is all cleaners and cleaning supplies. This fan heater, is that actually what's in there? It is, but there's also like- Ray-Bans. Four pairs of sunglasses buried on top. Which ones? I think these said Ray-Bans. These did, these did. They're plastic ones. So did these, so did these, and, and this pair didn't. But that's, yeah, that's dope. three pairs of Ray-Bans. That's easy money. And we even got a tooth uh brush head in it but i mean hey we'll take the ray-bans they can have this stuff at the yard sale one of the big questions i just have to figure out this bag right here because it's really freaking heavy and i don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing because right now why somebody would pay five thousand dollars for this unit is beyond me but i have to figure that out right now Ugh. get on here big boy let's see anything right. in here let's get into it no nothing what about here uh papers 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 in a baby cargo yeah nothing so it's got to be in the main compartment you'd think right yeah <gasps> no please please <gasps> it feels heavy please i beg of you please uh, there's the alien wear something there's a phone case Dang it. well this isn't looking great right now but there could be something buried under here uh well there's a laptop well, there was a laptop Oof. an asus laptop it's seen better days but yeah. you know it's still all there yeah there's a router oh look more foreign coins oh, one cool. penny what no more than that where are they all going get this paper out of here a little okay. bit of change <laughs> a little bit what are these cards here they have his name on it so we can't mess with those put those aside here wallet money give me the money give me the money come on I think out of all the things in the storage unit, wallets are probably the least often you find money in. Yeah, it's usually something like random box. <laughs> yeah, it is. What is that? These military coins or what? Challenge coin? Uh, what is that? It says T-Hawk Mav Micro Air Vehicle. So yeah, definitely some type of military stuff right there. A glare. There, there we go. go. All right. That. And then let's see what else is over here. Ah, this is... Well, it looks like somebody's old planner or something. Call of like Duty. That. Call of Duty Go. What is this for PC? Yeah. It is. is that ghosts for PC. Okay. Okay, that's kind of random. What about over here? These are papers. Papers. And, well. Ooh. What's this? What is this? Here. You. Uh, a wax melter. Watch. And a bunch of wires. And then we've got. Yeah, a little watch there. Some more Alienware stuff. We found like all the accessories to Alienware, except the actual computer. Look in this corner. I thought I saw a knife. Where? Hey, look. An iPod. We found an iPod. iPod Shuffle. Where do you see a knife? I thought it was over here, like in this corner. I sure don't. Whoa. But I see this. A Liberty coin from 1923. Nice. That's pretty good. What else is down here? Uh. Some more random coins. You know what I'm thinking we're gonna have to do with this stuff? Huh. There's your knife. I See, think I'm not crazy. We should take it <laughs> home 
And then with a dumpster next to us, pick through it with gloves so I don't get stuff all over my hands and we can throw the trash right away. And because if there's just random like coins like this in there, no telling what else we're gonna find. So a lot of those clothes that we had in that unit stunk really bad. So I really think we should throw them away instead of donate them. But at the same time, if we're finding silver coins randomly in there, I figured I can't just get rid of those bags without going through them. So we figured the best course of action is to bring it home, set up a table, bring the garbage cans next to us and go through those bags in detail and make sure there's no other silver or even golden coins hidden in those bags. So let's do that. We literally drove two and a half hours home with the windows down because it just stunk. But yeah. Here's all the stuff. So we're gonna take these bags and we're just gonna put them on this table and we're gonna make sure that whatever's in here is actually just what it is. Cause I would feel awful if I threw it away and some dumpster diver's like, hey, I found $10,000 in gold coins in one of those. So you know what I mean? We kinda gotta, ugh, gosh, it smells. Go through it. Cause I'm just not throwing it away like that. What is this thing? That's a Prada freaking like cologne Probably cap, like, isn't it? Yeah, perfume or something. I'm gonna set that aside in case there's a Prada bottle in here somewhere. Uh, I know you want these, right? <laughs> no, they're sure. Versace case though. Hey, look at that. They're Versace hangers. Yeah, I don't think that's how it works, but you know, <laughs> you don't want the hangers? Nah. All right, I asked. Um, let's see, what about this? This is just a book. Nah, nothing. Then lastly, this little thing, is that a vape? Yeah. It's a stupid vape. All right, that's literally all that's in that bag. So now right. we can feel okay with that bag going in the trash. One bag, check. I want to go to this one now. Oh, I'm trying to go like in order because I want to see every last piece of this unit. I really do. Because who just throws silver coins like in the bottom of a bag, you know? Yeah. There's nothing in there. We're going to make sure we check every last section. Like this stuff, garbage. What about the little gift bag? That's also garbage. Anything else in there? I see paperwork, but it's garbage. I am gonna pull this out. Bracelet, at least. Is that a charm bracelet? No, I don't know what it is. I just saw a little thing hanging on it. That says chaps, chaps. on it. So, I didn't see that before. It's not gold, but it's something. And that's all that's in this section. Let's go through the bigger section here. Yeah. What's in here? Hat, paperwork, that's just garbage. Luckily our garbage people come tomorrow, so we're out to just load our dumpsters <laughs> up right now while we go through this stuff. This is all just junk and junk and more junk. And did I mention junk? Should I open some of these envelopes too? Sure. Let's just open one. I don't want you to see his personal info, but I'm just gonna open like this one. Let's see what it is. This is no, these these are paperwork. These are definitely, yeah, these are definitely just paperwork. So let's get rid of them right there. This one's paperwork. This one's a book for something but it just everything just has this smell to it i don't know how to explain it it just doesn't smell good these are all papers and that's all paper is that every section of this bag what's that back here what is that card id this is his id yeah we probably should have brought that but i didn't see it before so maybe we'll set it aside and get it back to the facility next time other than that there's nothing in here let's dig in the rest of this clothes hamper here so this is like the suit gosh what is that they like wash this stuff in cow manure like it just smells awful and there's nothing in the pocket i'm going to check these inside pockets too i really don't want to touch it on my shirt because it smells horrible boss what does that say boss what boss moment boss moment whatever that is anything in there no no other pocket no yeah this is just too smelly like i would feel awful giving that to somebody what about the pants ah what is that see what is this this is why we check this is why we check that's a receipt. <laughs> but is there any money in there with it? No. Uh, no. There's gotta be more coins. I forgot what where we found that silver coin exactly, but it's gonna be more in here. I just feel it. Like, I just know there is. What about this bag right here? Ugh. Well, this is the kind of stuff I wanna go through. These are all the burned CDs we opened up already. Those are garbage. This is just dirty. Like, if it wasn't so gross, I'd probably keep some of this for yard sale slash donation, but it's just dirty. It's just really dirty. Uh, greatness, the 16 true characteristics That's of a champion. That's fine. Is it? Yeah. Hey, look. Cool. Okay. Hmm. I don't know who the author is, but look at the book. It's got mildew on it, don't it? Or mold, I mean. Yeah. I mean, we'll set it aside. I'll see if it comes off. If not, I'll throw it away. But yeah, it's just like a lot of just dirty stuff in here. And to think, like they said, this guy paid for four, four years, I think it was, with, and then just disappeared. So they paid over five grand on this unit. For what? 
That's why I feel like I have to go through it all. No, this is all papers as well. I got another hanger. I threw that cooking thing away as well. Remember the freaking seashells were in this jacket. But why does it smell so bad? I just can't, I can't, I just can't. That empty and this, yeah, th these are right here are all gonna go in the garbage as well. This bag I thought was just a pillow. This is the Versace bag. So let's pull the pillow out and see if that's actually the case. I didn't wanna go through it too much there because we only had like 45 minutes before we had to get out. That's a pillow. Oh, yes. We got other oh, busted open Pepsi. Pepsi. That's why the inside of this is so sticky and gross. It's a busted open Pepsi. Oh, there's a zipper inside the Versace bag though. And to be honest, I don't think this is a legitimate Versace bag, but let's open this up. There's nothing in there. So it's a fake bag covered in soda. Let's pull up this hamper right here and go through these bags. Cause one of these, I know I heard more coins in. Like I know I did. So we're not giving up until we find them all. Protein powder to the garbage. Bye bye. Yeah. Oh look, what the heck? Uh, see? See? This hey. is what I'm talking about. There's an iPad. It's smashed and it's covered in the um, what's it called? Protein, Protein powder. powder. But I mean, I'm pretty sure most Apple products come with a cracked screen, so it's not that big of a deal. We got that. We have paperwork, paperwork everywhere, and a very dirty pair of pants and a very ugly, dirty hat. So unfortunately. That's going over there. The umbrella. What is, like, I genuinely want to know what's all over this stuff that's so awful. Like, if I put this stuff in my garage, our garage would be uninhabitable within, like, <laughs> an hour or so. See, look at this already. Come here. I hate wearing gloves, but there's some random little coin already. We're going to set that over here. Ugh. This right here. Ugh. Yeah, this is all bathroom stuff from what I see. Oh, my gosh. What's in the hair dryer? Oh. Uh. A lot of dirty bathroom stuff in there. I'm just gonna go ahead and toss it. Gross. And this cleaner, that's going in the garbage. This is going in the garbage. Is this ramen? Every unit has to have ramen. To the garbage. Chicken ramen, that's good. It probably is. There's a lithium jump starter power pack, and let's see if that's really what that is, because the, the thing is cut, so it's been open. If I can get it open. This is just garbage nothing why would somebody do this why so far i mean we found some coins i just feel like there's a coin collection somewhere i really do and at the bottom of this this is more clothes more shoes and just dirty clothes so yeah this hamper is garbage too so i took the guitar out and let's bring this out i know we went through that i went through here and took out the stuff that wasn't coins so if i find more coins i could just toss them in there so ugh, let's rip open these bags here because there's a lot of randomness in here. I just don't believe it's all junk. That's the razor. Let's make sure it's actually just the razor. It's, let's see. Yeah, that's just not even the razor. It's just the razor heads. But that. Let's take this out of the box. Ugh, let's see what's in here first. That's sunflower seeds and a hat. Our trashy in here is almost full. I might have to one of the next one in a second. These are used paper plates. That's disgusting. Ugh. A vest and some used duct tape. Nasty. What are these? Are these garlic? Looks like it. Garlic? That could have been where some of the yeah. smell was coming from. What is that? I don't even know what that is. I don't even, you know what? Yeah, let's put that in there. That's just disgusting. Um, yeah, this one right here is definitely all food. There is one knife down here, but I don't even want it because it's covered in food. Other than that, yeah, no, this one's gonna go straight to the garbage can. Let's go into this box now, Ugh, right here, and see. Ugh. Oh my gosh. Like, you, you would think it's clean, but it's not. I don't know what it is, so, uh, gosh. I, I don't, what do you think? Should I toss it? No, because I don't, yeah, I mean, I would toss it because I don't know what the smell is coming from. Yeah, I just don't know. I don't know. I might lose out on like 20 bucks. 20 bucks for this, but I don't want that in the garage. And these are just still like, ugh. I also least... don't want to like sell it to someone with who knows what. On it. Yeah, you would think before you store your dishes, at least wash them. Like, I feel like that's what happened. They just stored them with who knows what on it. And just left it there for years. That's what it smells like. All right, let's go to this bag right here. Listen. Yeah, this here's is, changing that one. This is the one. Okay, we got to take this one seriously. Let's see what's in this bag. There's nothing here. No. 
Okay, let's see here. This is clothes, clothes. Are these the Ray-Bans we found earlier? No, these are some other glasses, so we'll put those garbage, they're Dollar Tree. This right here, khaki pants. These are the ones people like to put money in randomly. Mm -hmm. So, hey, like the few times we found money in pockets, I feel like both times or two or three times, it was always khakis. So I always check khaki, but gosh, they stink. Like, I swear this guy bathed in duty. I don't know what happened. This, ugh, dirty shoe. Uh, lots of papers. And um, what is this? Hold on, let's see. I want to take it off like this. See all these cards here? Uh, that's a, just a rewards thing. What about this wallet? No, and no. Ugh. And here is also another vape and papers. Not what we want to see. Uh, more paper. Again, we're just going to put this all in the garbage. I'm starting to see money down here, so this is probably the one. One of the ones we're looking for. There's probably more than one. What's about this? There's nothing in there. But do you see that change across? The, I'm starting to see across the bottom? Not yet. Oh, it's coming. It's coming. I promise you. Let's see. Yeah. Should I start dumping this bag out, maybe? Maybe. You think so? Yeah. All I right. think you can, like, centralize it so it doesn't fall everywhere. Let's see. You hear that? It's gonna fall everywhere, but as long as most of it... There's more change in here. <sighs> so I'm not throwing this out yet. But look at this, too. We got an iPhone that's typical iPhone condition broken let's see this Another is just junk iphone or something e that's an iPod. ipod okay a little ipod it's cracked there's another watch right here watch head actually calvin klein there's another watch right there what's in here anything no nothing so i see a bunch of coins but all this junk is in the way unfortunately like all this but I don't see any like silver anymore, do you? All I'm seeing is like some foreign coins along with some American like cheaper coins, you know, like pennies, quarters, these little boxcar coins. I don't even know what that is. It literally says boxcar on it. But other than that, I think that's all the coins that are in this bag. This bag right here feels like it's all closed, but I want to rip them open and see how they are, the condition, if they're worth keeping or if I should throw them away, to be honest. I don't want to waste but i also don't want to donate something that can have some gross stuff on it like ugh, like the smell of these is absolutely awful but i just want to go through these like every single pair of clothes they had i've said this like 20 times already but i don't know what he did i'm gonna dump this out see that bug is playing on me yeah real quick and just make sure it looks like it's all pants so I'll look through the pockets, and if there's no cash, we'll just throw them away. Let's go to the brown bag here. Oh, and I'll grab that alien thing too. Man, it just got done raining, and let me tell you, the humidity right now, it's only like 89, 90 degrees, which is still hot, but the humidity is just awful. Uh, yeah, there's nothing in here. What is that? Make sure this looks like something just the inserts would come in. Yeah, that's exactly what it is, so nothing in there. That's garbage. The brown bag right here. This is one of the first ones we went into. I think I went all the way into this one. So yeah, we went all the way into this one. There's nothing in there. The Calvin Klein bag here. I don't think this one had much of anything in it, but I'm gonna open it again just to be sure. Cause now I can really dig. Cause usually you guys know I don't really care for gloves. When something smells bad enough to where I feel the need to wear gloves, just know it freaking stinks. I think, yeah, I went through this one and I'm not seeing nothing else down there. A lot of lottery tickets, but again, Everyone we looked at at the facility was a loser, so he probably just kept them for tax purposes in case he won. This clothes hamper is one of the places I would think something might be, because I think this is where we found the PlayStation controller originally, right? In the little Asus laptop. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, so let's dump this on its side. And again, just because everything is gross, the clothes I'm not even gonna bother with anymore. They're just awful. So they're gonna go right into the garbage like this as we go through them and make sure there's nothing. Oh my gosh. Make sure there's nothing in between them. Mm -hmm. If I can get through it. Uh, well, there's a garbage bag. Thank you. We could have used those. They're not even in there. You know what? Mm -hmm. There's one in there. There's something. We'll keep that. Uh, no, no. These are just dirty, stinky clothes. So this little pink box here, pretty sure. I don't know if this is where we found the glasses or this is where we put them, but that was a pair of Ray-Bans. This one's not, but I'll look them up just in case. 
This one was, right? No, they're not either. I thought there was two. Oh, here they are. Ray-Bans. And that's just, oh gosh. I feel like that wouldn't even heat you. That would just poison you. The smell of it is awful. This here, what do we have? Open up. Dirty shoes. Yeah, they're just unusable. We're gonna put them in there. This right here definitely looks like straight garbage, but just because of the silver, I gotta move the stuff around a little bit for my own well-being. Oh, there's all kinds of coins down there. That's exactly what I'm talking about, yep. I was just about to say we should toss that, but this is why you don't. There's all kinds of coins at the bottom of this bag. I don't know if they're, if it's just everyday change or what. These are gross, look down there. Whoa. There's a lot down there. Uh, is this a crystal or is this a crystal like smokable substance? Don't know. I don't know, I'm gonna throw it away just in case. Look down at the bottom, you see that? Yeah. There's a lot of change down here. I don't even want to know. Uh, I, I don't, I don't. <laughs> I don't want to know. We're just gonna go ahead and toss it away right now. So if after I end up getting all this out the way, I'm trying to throw all the garbage in here away and then dump the change out so you can see how much it is. Should I dump the change on the table? Yeah, yeah. Let's see, hold on. That's a decent little amount. It's not a lot, you know. If, you, if I did what I had, more of these on hand, maybe the unit wouldn't have been so bad. But overall, I bet you that's a few dollars. There's a lot more garbage in here than you think. We have five bins and we've already filled up four or three. One was already full. And then we got the last one here. Hopefully we can fit all this garbage to avoid going to the dump. Because mm -hmm. I'm kind of lazy and the dump's annoying, especially on Friday because it's always packed. Yeah. Let's go into this suitcase. This is just more clothes that just smell like they were smeared in dog duty before packing. Yeah, all here is clothes. There's nothing at the top, is there? Nothing in here, nothing. No, this is just gonna have to go to the garbage, unfortunately. I just pulled three bags out in a row that were nothing but clothes, so this is the only other one that had something hard in it. I can't tell, it's definitely shoes, I don't know. What in the heck was that, a bird? Yeah, it was a bird that I couldn't get on camera. <laughs> okay, so yeah, these are dirty shoes again, unfortunately. This is like an iron, but I'm gonna dig in here a little bit more. And unfortunately, I'm not seeing anything mm. other than clothes in here. The thing I was probably most interested in deep searching was this suitcase, because this thing had a lot of cool stuff in it, like right off the bat, don't you fall over, please. Okay, so let's see. There's nothing else in there. There's nothing else in here. But now we get to go through here. Like this box definitely has some cards and some coins in it, so I'm gonna take the cards out. Just add the coins. It's not silver, nothing, it's just change. So we'll throw that away. This here, what is that? Ugh, tax turn. Boring. Let's see, yeah, 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 that's them. I just like to see if they have other people's stuff. This right here, all paperwork again. No thank you. What about up here? Look, did I open this? I don't think I don't so. <laughs> I'm here. Happy birthday. With nothing in it, unfortunately. Um, well, we got this laptop. I know we showed that. Is that the battery to it? Not sure. We'll open this. And what was in here again? Some random wires that are just really sticky. So there's no point of keeping those. We're just gonna put those over there. This right here, the art of discovery. It's just a book. I mean, we'll look that up. Some books are expensive papers old like cisco certification guide that is old uh that sounds interesting let's see i'm really running out of trash room here no. i didn't think a five by five would have that much garbage in it but you never know huh uh other than there's another watch right here so we got a watch we'll keep that but yeah other than that it's the broken pieces of a watch and there's another head to one there's a penny in there so there's some kind of coins in this an old nokia the mm -hmm. indestructible thing we'll set that aside now let's come over here really quick there's that challenge coin i remember putting this back in here for sure so those will go over here call of duty ghost is that even in there yeah ghost all right we went through his wallet which had nothing unfortunately so let's get to the bottom i see coins down here this is gonna take a while to dig through. I went through all the rest of that suitcase and guess what I found? This is literally it. That's literally it. Definitely not one of our best storage units. Definitely not. 